that utility trailer. Sunfish, I'm picking my trailer up in Arkansas. I'm going to show you guys what a trailer lot looks like when you go out here looking for this one little trailer and thousands of trailers. And thanks for the shout out and the deal there. And tell Dan I, the stickers are laying right in the seat when we was talking about it. And I just all forgot about it. Yeah, wait till I get out here and these this parking lot you'll see the trailers there's thousands of them back here and you gotta look at a little tag on the front of the trailer and find yours they got several different lots here they go color coded yellow blue black green orange red we're going to the yellow lot It's going to be a short video here, guys. I see that. I'm just showing everybody what I do when I go pick up a new trailer. We're looking for trailer number... even in yellow lot yet. Trailers after trailers after trailers. Barcodes was a number on the front of the trailers here, and you gotta look for that one. Now we're coming into Yellow Lot. It's one of the biggest lots. It takes forever to go through it. it might be a little faster today because I know what the trailers got a marking, the harbor lines or something. Usually I just get a plain white trailer, so it makes it even harder. But. Hi 
Dan. I'm headed up your way again, headed up towards St. Paul. Uh, 898-4042. We want 004. Hi, Sarah. This is what I do when I come into a lot looking for a trailer. All these trailers, so rows and rows of them. Chiropractor, so she couldn't come in here. I was going to go stream yard, let her talk to you guys while I was doing this, but she wouldn't do it. She don't like me. Zero four seven zero. Right down in the bottom of that barcode, that's what we're looking for. Nope, gotta get the one that's got that number on it. And you ain't got it, you gotta go back if they can't find it. They come out here once in a while, will help you, but not very often. They, they don't like coming back here. To, Lots a little cleaner than usually is. They got them double parked sometimes and I have to go up and make them move a trailer because I don't move their trailers. Most of these are sold there by somebody's bottom. They don't usually make them until they're sold. just got a notification sunfish king from you for something like can't see it right now or a message get done here I'll look it up this parking lot is rough too guys and it ain't bad today it's been rained here in a while a lot of times it's muddy here. You gotta drive through all kinds of mud holes. I hate that. You guys see me keeping my truck washed all the time, so it ain't too bad. It's a little dusty day if you go too fast, but but it's rough. They come in here once in a while and grade it, make it a little smoother, but it's gravel somewhat. Yes, I got my glasses on. There was one up that row there. Let's go down around here first. I don't see none. It's probably the one back up front. I went past, I didn't see the number. 
I hope it's one of them that's got the marking on it. I'm just looking for the marquee one right now. Usually you gotta look at every trailer because I get just a plain white one. Oh, I see some up at the other end, so. There's one over here. There's one over there. I say it's H A L B O R lines. They got a, they bought a lot of trailers of the bike. Sometimes it could take you an hour driving around here circles trying to find a damn trailer. Yeah, it'd be nice if they pulled them out. There is a few places I go, you call ahead and they'll have them sitting out for you, but these guys don't. Only reason they'll come find it here is if you can't find it, then they'll send the shag drivers out here, but you might wait an hour for the shag drivers to show up. I got it on personal conveyance right now running on my clock. So I don't have to run my clock down. Oh, uh, looky here, guys. 898404. I'll see if I can pull up. You can see that. I can't get into it to dolly a damn thing up, though. Pull up this. See that tag right there on the front? 898-84004. That's mine. I got it find a damn shag driver though to move it away there ain't no way my fat ass would fit in there and usually they ain't got the dollies enough to drag them out but yeah, look at that how close they got that trailer I can't get in there so I gotta find me a shag driver Oh, you guys couldn't see it? Oh, okay. I didn't know if you could or not. Let me see if I can find a damn shag driver and pull that out.
working class fisherman broadcasters on now. drops him, they're trying to tell him he, he's never drove a truck in his life. They could have given him a job doing this and he don't park the trailer straight or nothing else, but it makes it rough on everybody. He don't work for utility, he does the decals. He couldn't come move the trailer real quick. So I gotta chase one of these others down. I seen one come around the corner here. Where he go? There he is. bunch of fucking bullshit. They're right here. They can't move it. I gotta go tell the guard how to move the damn thing. Hell, that one's got a mud flap missing on already. Lazy fuckers. 
sorry about that. Just irritating. Wasting my time down here because they can't park them straight. They're right here by me and then they can't go get the damn trailer. All I gotta do is move it over a foot. I should have hooked onto it and drugged the damn thing. But some damaged on it and it's my fault. I was having a pretty good day. and wait for him to show up. They got the driveway so full. They usually don't have these trailers right here in the drive. You come up here and they check you out. I don't know why they drug all these up here. I'm missing chat. Wait, you guys, I'll turn around here and see what you guys are saying. It ain't just always driving down the road, there's always something. Hi Mike, I'm irritated. Yeah, it is, Shannon. No, you can't call the guard check, they won't answer the phone. Them chat drivers right there. So. Yeah, I need directions back. Like a cluster fuck trying to get around out here. They got so much shit right in the way. You gotta watch around these corners too. Those tag drivers drive like hell. That's why I put it on personal convenience when I'm here. Because you never know how long you're going to be here. How long have I been live? Uh, 25 or 30 minutes. And I still ain't got my trailer. See, it takes a while. Yep, you drive too slow for this. You got to be in a hurry.
You can work here though, they don't care. They ride around here, do at their own speed, they can go slow and just park them wherever you want. Now some of the lots, they have rows. Like I could go down this row here and look at the trailers and it'd be a certain row. But here they do the whole goddamn lot. So you gotta go all the way through it. Because their shag drivers are too lazy to organize them. Now there's another utility up in Kankakee, Illinois. They do rows. They got A, B, C, and D, and E row. They're long rows, but at least it's right in one row. gone to the chiropractor yet? He's whining and whining. It's called me a crybaby. all the way around see it's right here at the beginning I always do that I always go the wrong direction there's a shack driver right there I wonder if he's gonna move it Oh, he's driving on by. They got radios in every one of them tag trucks. Mike, you keep eating them hamburgers, them seven by seven, you're gonna get as fat as me. guys well you see what I got to do here there's a tag truck coming around the corner now so I'm gonna get off here you see what it's like doing this so I just saw the show you so I'll see you